Zach, who told you this? It was Cody. It was Muriel. It was Esteban. It was London. Oh, I curse these lips. They cannot keep themselves sealed. I know. I will hold them together to keep from spreading rumors again. Where is she? In her room. I want to know why you started that rumor about me and Lance. What rumor? That Lance and I are getting married, moving to a vineyard in Vegas, and becoming blackjack dealers? Congratulations! You're going to be a blackjack dealer! London, I am not going to be a blackjack dealer. And I am not getting married. Oh, good. You're much too young. Oh. <sighs> London, London. Why did you tell Esteban that Lance and I are back together? Because I saw you lip locking in the lounge. Oh, he was teaching me CPR. Is that the same as peeling the grape? It's mouth to mouth. So it is the same. <laughs> Forget about it. The problem is, everybody at the hotel is talking about how we're back together. Then you should be thanking me. Maddie, having people talk about you is a good thing. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. Gossip hurts. That's why I wouldn't do it. How would you feel if people were spreading rumors about you? Hey, every time I'm in the paper, my social life just gets better and better. Yeah? Well, my social life is going down the tubes because Chuck heard your lie and dumped me. Oh, honey. I heard a rumor he was going to dump you anyway. <laughs> my emails. Even when I use a cute little smiley face. <laughs> See, this is what I meant by rumors hurting people. Even though in this case, the person may not have even known they were starting it. And they're probably really, really, really sorry. <laughs> not as really, really, really sorry as they'll be when they get fired. Mosby said he had a lead. <gasps> Esteban, I know you know who gossiped about London. Why do you say that? Because you were seen skipping down the hallway singing, I know who it is, I know who it is, I who know is who it is. <laughs> I will not write out on a fellow employee. Spill it, or I'll have you transferred to the Mr. Mosby, you can't fire Chuck. He didn't talk to the reporter. I did. <gasps> <laughs> Maddie, why would you do such a thing? I'm surprised at you. Yeah, I thought you never gossiped. Well, I didn't do it on purpose. I, I didn't even know that woman was a reporter. Oh, so you just gossip about me in general? Only because you gossiped about me and it spread through the whole hotel. Well, you gossiped about me and it spread all over the world. But you started it. Nuh uh huh. Oh, don't you uh huh my nuh uh. <laughs> I think you are both at fault here. And I think we can all learn something from this. Even though gossiping is an irresistible temptation, on any level, gossip is hurtful. Now, the best way to not spread it is to not listen to it. London. Maddie, I'm sorry I started all this. Next time I see you lip locking, I'll come to you first before I start telling people. That's all I ask. And I'm sorry I let my anger get the better of me. And I'm sorry about the things I wrote about you in the staff lounge. <gasps> Great! We have a staff lounge, but no dungeon? <laughs>